before. The Supreme Court has dismissed a plea by the Congress spokesperson Pavan Khera for the quashing of criminal proceedings against him over a remark about Prime Minister Narendra Modi. To get us more on this, we'll cross back over to my colleague Harish. Uh, Harish, over to you. Tell us more about this. Yes, it's a big setback for senior Congress leader and uh, senior spokesperson for the party, uh, Pawan Khera, as uh, now he will have to face trial uh, for the uh, remarks uh, calling the referring to referring uh, Prime Minister uh, 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 Prime Minister Narendra Modi's name as uh, Narendra Gautam Das uh, Modi, referring to uh, Adani. Uh, and uh, uh, but though he said that uh, he had apologized later, uh, the uh, the UP police had in fact booked him for several charges, including uh, causing uh, enmity between groups, uh, disturbing public peace, defamation, and all. Uh, uh, so, uh, but the, his lawyer questioned how can all these charges be invoked in a simple offense uh, which, for which he had uh, uh, apologized and wondered if it was an offense at all. But uh, Supreme Court said that, uh, but Solicitor General Tushar Mehta appearing for the uh, UP government said that charge sheet is about to be filed and trial will be over very soon. There's no need uh, for Supreme Court to intervene at this stage. So uh, Supreme Court said that it, will, it is not interfering uh, and made a comment like uh, you, uh, you keep apologizing, you try, you, you think that you can wish away the offense mm -hmm. by apologizing. Even the uh, UP government said that uh, uh, apologizing uh, does not uh, cure one of a criminal offense. Absolutely, so it's Harish, a big thank you for so much for joining us and for giving us all of those uh, details. With this, we're going to be heading into a very short break, but do stay tuned because we'll be right back.